good morning. It was a really good morning because I woke up today. Um, they gave me my last shot, shot number 10 that I have to take in one of my arms and I was so happy. Let me see what else. Cleaned up my stomach, cleaned my navel, changed everything, you know, put the Neosporin, emptied these. Yes, I'm still wearing it. Emptied them. And then I was like, okay, I'm taking my shower. Call the doctor. They're like, yeah, come in at 12. We'll take it off. Apparently, they didn't tell me to milk these, which means to get the blood out of the stretch and get the blood out of the tubes because that counts as fluid, of course, as well. No one told me to do that. Um, it's blood red, so... To me, it seems that it's been stuck in these tubes. And that's what I told the doctor. But, you know, shortly after she milked it, more came out. And I'm just so confused because we've been seeing yellowish orange fluid come out. And now red fluid coming out. So they told me they're not taking it off of me today. And got to go put my prescription in for some more shots. Um, I'm wearing this for two more days at this point. Guess I'm gonna be for real on bed rest this time. It's okay. Everything happens for a reason. Good morning. I did something to myself today because I'm excited. I'm getting these drains off today. What they look like today is barely anything. I'm so freaking excited. And then after this, off to buy my Colombian Faja bodysuit, whatever. Okay, so today I went to my doctor's appointment where they took out those drains that were weighing me down, finally. Um, I still do have to wear this and I do have to get my bodysuit, but I realized it was $120 today. I'm going to have to go back tomorrow and get it. So, I love my results. I can't see it when I'm laying down. I'm like a fat person who's not fat because I just can't see. It's so flat. I can't see it when I'm laying down. I can only see it in the mirror and in pictures. Um, and it's still very numb. And it feels so good. I still have tape on me. Um, I have to have the tape changed every two weeks. For the next two months. Um, I have a nice scar right there. Which and a little bit of stretch mark left. I believe right here. We'll be getting a tattoo over. Gotta clean my belly button twice. Not clean it. Give it some Neosporin twice a day. But um, I'm liking the results. I'm really loving it. So I'm about to clean my belly button. And oh. So when they pulled out my drains. The doctor said, she said, okay, you're going to take a deep breath. I had two drains connected to me somehow. It happened while I was under anesthesia and surgery. So I had two drains inside of me. So she pulled. Okay. So I'm clenching like this while she's pulling. She was like, take a deep breath. So I took a deep breath. I swear, I felt this drain come from right here all the way out. So I was prepared for the next one that came from right here all the way out. Glad they're gone. They were weighing me down. I can stand up a little straighter even though I still have to wear body gear. But yes, time to clean my belly button. I love it. I'm excited. This is gross. I gotta clean that and replace it. Side note. This gives me the heebie-jeebies. There's a hole now for my actual belly button. That's the scar, but it's a hole. Ew. If it were, it was it. But that is so nasty. If this were a regular cut, I would pick the hell out of it, but can't touch it. Okay, so this should be my last day of coming to get my tapes changed, which should be good for about two weeks. Um, I am very excited. Well, nothing really changes. But, and it's kind of nice because with these tapes, I can hide them with my underwear because I do have a photo shoot later. So, they can be hidden, but, um, they're very well. 
and I'll show you my scar shortly. Stomach's ashy because the tape was just removed. So actually, no tape for my scar. Do you see it? It's gonna be gone in six weeks. 